afternoon. What do you got to say about this particular day, Gary? It's, uh, oh, what is it? It's Christmas Day, <laughs> the sun's shining, there's not a cloud in sight, that's unheard of in uh, Belgium, so a little bit of a Christmas miracle. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, Merry Christmas. Although this is gonna come out a few days after Christmas, I still would portray a very happy day. Go Japan! Woo! Uh, yeah, woke up Zolder course inspection day. It's going down right now.
ago, we had the mud that we had. And now, hard pack sand, like traction for days. Not a, I mean, three puddles, two puddles, nothing. Wild. It's amazing how each track has its own character to it. Hey. on the bikes yes yes and and I'd say a big thank you to these guys him and these guys Tim Stan yes thank you for letting us park here we're uh, we're deep in the trenches here in the in the compound thanks guys uh, it's day after Christmas and we're racing some World Cup cyclocross at Houston Zolder. This is the form, the circuit, circuit, uh, days older. The circuit Zolder. Track is fast, as you saw yesterday. Fast, dry, sandy as all get out. But great day, great day. A uh, brief talking point. Uh, there was some real haterade getting drank last night uh, via YouTube. I saw three. I know you're just a whopping number, but three. Like I usually the the YouTube comments hate is a minimum for me three negative comments overnight like in a couple hours like come on guys what did santa leave coal in your stocking on christmas day you gotta be mean whatever whatever don't care but just saying be nice why why leave a comment why leave a nasty comment all right so as we said the other day in namur we had a certain super fan that brought us chocolates hi say. and what would you say the most iconic quote Good morning. Yes. yes. Thank you. No problem. Yes. Right. He ate all the chocolates, by the way. I didn't eat any. I haven't had any all yet. Chocolates. When you work on bikes, you need lots of chocolates. <laughs> this is the compound. Open the road. Mark Snell. Mark Snell. He is the Zolder Mark. A four power Mark Pitts. Yeah. All right. Post race. Didn't get a whole lot at the venue. We are in the Belgian compound, as I showed you. Um, pretty solid race. Fast is all good out. We raced 53 minutes. So, for all you commenters out there, haters out there, we got a pretty solid, solid start into turn one, two into the pit. If you've watched older before, it's always the famous first turn where everything bottlenecks coming into pit one. Right there, I got pinched. I got pinched real hard. Uh, we actually just watched the preview back and didn't realize how hard I actually got pinched because coming out of it, there were only like two guys behind me. <laughs> so that was not good. And then from there, chased all the way back, I believe, to 48th. So 248th uh, here in Europe. Not bad. Freaking fast. Sandy. It was crazy how the course dried out and how there was like literally no mud on the track at all. 100% sand, hard pack. And then today, of to top it off, uh, overnight, everything froze. So the ground was rock solid. And the sections that were getting a lot of friction through them in the turns, they were getting soft, starting to get a little wet there. But for the most part, anything that was, was not putting a lot of friction into was rock, rock hard. Now, a lot of people have been asking, like, why not race Lowenhout, Degum, Ball, Bredena. There's a bunch of others that are over this holy week of cross. I definitely could. Um, not going to be scoring points and didn't really see it fit to do so. So yes, it's a good experience. Yes, it gets you faster. Um, but we get home. We'll do some training. We came here to score points. We scored points. And uh, yeah, absolutely. So all in all, pretty solid. Boom. <laughs>